Hello guys, it's Johnny Tam again and welcome to another DeFi tutorial. Today we are going to learn how you can easily use PancakeSwap on your mobile phone using MetaMask browser and specifically iPhone. I will make another tutorial for Android phones but for now I will do an iPhone. If you are not familiar with what PancakeSwap is, what is MetaMask, what is Binance Martian, please check out my channel. I have a lot of videos of tutorials that basically I explain all these kind of fundamentals, all the basics. In this video, I assume that you already know what PancakeSwap, you already know what MetaMask is and you already know what is Binance Smart Chain. Also, make sure that you are subscribed to the channel and click on the bell icon and select all so every time I publish new videos you can get a notification and watch it and learn about DeFi. So let's get into business. Just one moment, let me take the phone. So first you will have, if you have an iPhone, you will have to download the MetaMask app. So let's download MetaMask and this is the MetaMask app, same as the browser extension. And after downloading, basically you will have the app, the, the, the orange fox that you all know and familiar with and you can open the web, the web app. And the UI is very nice, very easy to use, very convenient. In the first time that you will open, you will not see my screen right now. So I have a wallet already created, but you will be requested to create a new wallet or import an existing wallet. This is exactly like in your extension in your browser, if it's Chrome or Brave browser, you can create new wallet with a new seed phrase or you can get an existing seed phrase. You can use the same browser that you use in your, uh, in your extension, in your computer and you can import it to the phone if you wanna make transactions on the mobile phone. Uh, you can also create a new wallet if you want it to be more hot, but make sure that it does not hold a lot of coins because it's your mobile phone and if it gets stolen, then someone can uh, take advantage of it and steal your tokens. You can also protect it with password like you have in your browser and you can choose a password when you create the MetaMask wallet. So I'm going to the hamburger right here on the left and right now you will see a bit different screen because I already have the app and I already have accounts here. But if you go here, you can import an account. So basically I can write the private key or scan a QR code. And by providing the private key of my wallet, I can import it into my app on MetaMask or other option will be to create a new account. So right now uh, I have a new account here and I can, you can create as much accounts as you can, same as the browser. And the next thing that you will have to do after created account or imported account is to add the Binance Smart Chain to your MetaMask wallet. By default, it will be with Ethereum mainnet. So this is the Ethereum blockchain, like you can see, but you can always change it and add. You need to add because by default, you don't have Binance Smart Chain. So in order to add a Binance Smart Chain, you go to the menu and then scroll down to all the way to settings. And then you scroll a bit down, go to networks and add network. You can see here that in my case, I have RPC networks. I added it manually. You can just click add network, put, provide all the information of the Binance Smart Chain. So you will be able to interact with PancakeSwap decentralized app because it's on the Binance Smart Chain only. Also, you can use this uh, mobile app, this, this uh, MetaMask app to interact with Ethereum dApps like Uniswap, SushiSwap, one inch and everything. Uh, but for that example, we'll need to add um, Binance Smart Chain to the app. So after adding the Binance Smart Chain, I will not show it right now because I have another tutorial for it. You, I will put a link in the description below and also you can check out my channel. After adding the Binance Smart Chain, you will have it right here. So you can see here is all the information, BSC, the, dat, the URL, RPC URL, chain ID, symbol and blockchain explorer URL. Once done, you can basically change the chain here on the top screen, you have networks and you can click and change to Binance Smart Chain. So now I'm on Binance Smart Chain and I'm gonna open the menu again and click browser. Remember, you will only be able to use PancakeSwap through the browser which resides within the MetaMask app because this browser is able to interact with Web 3.0 and send transaction using your MetaMask wallet. So you cannot use just a normal Safari or Chrome or Firefox browser. You will have to use the browser within the MetaMask app. So I will click browser here and here I, I have a new browser. And by clicking the plus, I will add a new uh, tab and I will search for PancakeSwap. PancakeSwap. And they use DuckDuckGo as the default search engine. I will go to the first result. 
and you can see that automatically I have a pop-up that asks me to connect my wallet to the banking swap website exactly like you have in your browser with your extension so it's the exact same thing I will click connect and now my wallet is connected to PancakeSwap and now I can do trades I can do basically swaps I can do staking farming provide liquidity remove liquidity play in the lottery play in the predictions whatever I want through my mobile app through my iPhone device which is very very nice very easy I know that most of you had problems with uh, trust wallet or any other solution so for me the best option is using metamask because it's very easy to combine my wallet in my web browser to my mobile phone and it's very convenient when i want to do a swap or a trade or do something urgent i can just take out my phone open metamask and do the transaction very very easily for example let's say i want to buy a cake token so i'll just choose cake i'll put one bnb right now this wallet is empty so i have insufficient bnb balance but Again, once you will have the right amount of balance, you will just click swap and a, a pop-up will be popped here on your application. You will just click confirm. You can change the gas. You can change everything the same in your extension browser. So this is very easy, very convenient, and I myself use it. So that's why I prepared this video to help you guys out. Uh, if you want to uh, trade and hold tokens from your mobile phone very easily using PancakeSwap, also it will work with Uniswap or any other uh, decentralized exchange. So I hope this guy was useful for you. I hope you enjoyed it and you learned something new. And if you have any questions, feel free to ask them in the comments below. And I will very appreciate if you will like my video and share with your friends that are struggling with using PancakeSwap from iPhone. And thank you so much. See you next time. Bye bye.